decorations up so I thought I'd do clothes for this she doesn't have many in ears because she doesn't like Christmas <laughs> she does like Christmas secretly no I don't but she loves Christmas that much she keeps this one little sticker on the whole year show them just to remind her that little sticker is there all year round she won't ever take it down because i forgot to take it down one year so she likes to keep it up <laughs> is that because it it's like a lucky snowflake yeah. not that it's ever brought me any good luck if i haven't been hit by a bus so you never know chloe has a rudolph and an olaf that's about it <laughs> That's as far as my Christmas spirit goes. Yeah. Uh, I think that's Rudolph done. Oh, look, there's the other one, isn't it? Oh, the two Olaf. Oh, he's just looking. His body. I thought Olaf went on that window. Olaf goes on this side. Olaf's gone on this side. This is fascinating content. <laughs> Well, it's very delicate peeling. Sticky jelly stickers. Oh, God, they're gross. I forgot what he looks like. He's a snowman. Does he have legs? No, Olaf doesn't have legs. He has sticks as arms, but he doesn't have legs. I don't think he has legs. No, he doesn't have legs. I don't know if he has legs on that drawing, but I don't think he has legs. Doesn't he just bounce? Yeah, I don't think so. Hi everybody, today I'm going a snowflakey theme. These are my favourite doodly boppers. I love this jumper because it's so warm. Just hope work isn't too hot today because it's probably going to be busy. Catch you later, bye. Look, my window's done. I've got Olaf and some snowflakes. And then a reindeer, and it says let it snow. Yay! My room's Christmas-ified. My mum got in really late last night for my Christmas party. And she came back with this giant bear. I think she won it from a raffle or something. And she gave it to me. But this bear is huge. But she got back late last night, or should I say early this morning. And came home with a giant bear. So if you have any suggestions for a name, it would be greatly appreciated. But he is cute, bless him. But he's huge. My mum has done her window as well with tinsel and window stickers. She can tell she appreciates Christmas a lot more than me. And look, she's got tinsel everywhere. Hey everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 5! Woo! Day 5. We're in this, people. And we are surviving. <laughs> now it's time for the advent calendars. First one, postcode lottery. Eight, four, 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 four. Number four is right there. Oh, it's all about dementia. How lovely. Now time for my little pony. Right, number four. I honestly didn't even know My Little Pony still existed. That took in an embarrassing amount of time, so number four is there. <laughs> I really couldn't find number four. Now I can't get it open. Oh, that was... I, should... I think it's some holly. Now the Cadbury's one. Hopefully I can find this more or less straight away. Oh, thank gosh. Number four. 
give hugs at Christmas. That's a nice one. Oh, it's a snowman. I can actually see that one for a change. Now it's time for Echo's one. Right, where are you? Number four. Oh, it's a bauble. How cute. Let's see if I'll actually eat this on camera this time. Echo, get your treat. Is it? And just like that, he eats it when you walk away. <laughs> you fussy little dog. You are, aren't you? <laughs> Good boy. Time for the family advent calendar. They're really hard to get out. Oi, silver coin. I've just put the Sprinkle of Courage video for this week live, which is good. I was really worried about how I was gonna be able to manage doing Vlogmas and Sprinkle of Courage videos, but the first week is done. I have done that, I've managed to put out both. So that is great and that is a load off my shoulders. I just have to put out Vlogmas for today later. And then that responsibility is done for the day. My mum is at work now for the rest of the day and evening. She's there until it closes. She won't be back till around 11 o'clock or later tonight. So it is me and the little munchkin, if you can see him in the back in his bed. And it is gonna be a quiet day, really. Monday for me is more sprinkle of courage stuff. I normally get a lot more people wanting to talk on a Monday and discuss the videos and just generally want to have a chat. So Monday for me is more sprinkle of courage wise and spending time on that website and talking to people and just trying to help. But tomorrow should be fun because my mum has her day off, which means the house is gonna get Christmas nuts, which means she will wake up and she will wanna get it all done in a day. She will literally want to get everything done and sorted tomorrow, which means I should be able to have some really nice Christmassy footage, unless anything goes wrong, <laughs> which I really hope I haven't just jinxed it like something terribly wrong is gonna happen. We should have some Christmassy footage coming your way with fairy lights, the Christmas tree, window stickers, so hopefully that'll be coming your way soon and It'll properly feel more like Christmassy when the house is done up. This is the latest we've put it up for a long time. We normally put it up probably the first or the first few days. It normally takes a few days to put it up because we have so much Christmas crap, as I call it. But because my mum just hasn't had a day off, she hasn't been able to put it up. And I cannot put it up. I cannot because I will put it up in the wrong way, in the wrong order, or and my mum will come home and she'll just want to redo it herself anyway. And she loves it. She loves putting it all up, whereas I don't. So I let her get on with it. And I appreciate the finished product. So hopefully you will be able to see some Christmas footage soon. And it's nap time for the little man. Hey, you tired? Yeah, it's about his nap time. <laughs> He's a cutie, bless him. Being a grown up, the work is never done. Oh God.
best friends, Louise, told us a Christmas joke today. And it has an inside joke. We have an inside thing about pineapples. This is why she told us the joke. But all my other best friends are down. As you can see, our names are on the Twitter there. But she said this one. What do you get if you cross a Christmas tree with an apple? And the thing was a pineapple. So I brought to you your first Christmas joke. A terrible Christmas joke. Courtesy of one of my best friends, Louise. But there you go, your first Christmas joke from my channel. And just like that, Vlogmas Day 4 is live. Whoop whoop, another day done. It's a fair.